it's going to be it's going to be intense. Bingo. How's that?
consultant and also for developer and IT team here. So uh, I guess the interesting part is, is you know, since I'm not somebody who's been around teaching a brand, right? You know, where do I get off feeling like I can teach this class? So it's a lot of practical stuff that I've learned over the years. And for me, the thing that's exciting about, about teaching a class like this uh, is to bring a little bit of the engineering perspective into computer science at Brandeis. I know when I was here, and it's very different now, uh, the idea of a business school would have been like horrible because it was like too practical. Uh, we were liberal arts, and that's it. So now it's obviously <laughs> going in the right direction. But in computer science, still, I think you know, we can do some more. Um, things I've done work-wise over the years, uh, it's always been working on projects where there was a computer involved, and which I, for one reason or another, found very interesting and exciting. So I was able, I was lucky enough to be able to pick things that were exciting to me, and I think that's kind of what, what you want to get across here in this course. There's a lot to learn, <coughs> but there's also a lot of things that are really cool and really fun. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if, if, if we're lucky, you do something that actually has an impact on people and has so what I'm working on right now, other than teaching at Brandeis, is this uh, open source system called the Open Source Digital Voting Foundation, where we're building technology to run elections. Open source technology to allow, and I'll, I, you know, if you guys are interested, sometime during the summer I'll give you more detail and show you some of the demos. But basically, to build software that's going to be used by American uh, government entities to run elections instead of what today is commercial software that's expensive. Anyway, so um, uh, hopefully you've had a chance to look at the website for the course, but let me just give you some of the interesting tidbits that you're gonna see. Because I'm very proud of the organization, I have to say, I spent a lot of time on it. But basically, it's pretty simple. Uh, if you click on this tab, site map, you see that on the left here, there's the, the curriculum, the daily, daily schedule. You'll notice at the bottom that you have to label it with pins, that's because you're not sure where the W comes down go. Uh, you may be doubling something around today. Um, so, you know, uh, there's a lot of detail in the front. I, a high amount of detail, I'll try to break down. But if you want to see what happens uh, in the class, it's fast. You'll be here as we move things around. If we push something to another day or whatever, I'll reorganize it so as we go through, we can then give you a record of, of what we did. Uh, and sometimes it'll give you a viewer to be able to play around. Uh, if you look at any particular entry, as, as I'm sure you have, um, you see that, uh, well actually this is not a good example, but this one is. Every day begins with a homework and preparation for this lecture, and the idea is that uh, this will tell you exactly what's expected for, for the next day. Um, and um, in every case, um, we'll have you submit things electronically uh, through uh, a homework log, which I'll show you in a minute.
somebody in my life really wants to get to know someone a little bit better. Um, I, I tend to do that. I keep five on the phone. And, and you know, don't talk to everybody on the phone. It's easy for me to get lost in the chat and forget about what it is that you want. And I'm a person, so it gets very analytical. It gets fascinating. Thank you. 
to the word of the God that asks the question, come to me. Every prayer that we have asked for could be heard in this room. Uh, and I think that the prayers that people have had in our mind today, we may not all realize, we may not be exactly the person that prayed for the church that just got here. And, and we can ask these prayers for different people. We can ask for prayers for your family.
before you come up here, I felt that way. But you know, right here in this class itself, uh, you really do have a lot to say about this. You have a lot to say about this.
could have you know, New York walk legal immigrants and other folks uh, uh, across the Indian Ocean. Yeah. So you know, could have made up New Jersey. This, to me, this is actually more credible. But you could check the font. Did anybody check if there's not just a huge mark of one in New York next to it? Thank you. What if, what if someone 